Liam Hill sponsors Bellevue versus Hay 2 on Sky Sports Box Office. Wingy Boxing IFL TV in association with MTK Global, Black Country Boxing, Neutral Grounds, and we have the new. So, talk us through the fight. Um, that was a <laughs> that was value for money for the fans, wasn't it? Yeah, I hope everybody enjoyed it. It was um, it was brilliant. Um, we knew what he was going to do. A couple of times, I, I eased off a little bit and I let him have a go. Feel felt his power. And uh, I just pressed him. I was, in, I was enjoying it, and I, will, I was getting stronger as the rounds gone on. And that's what I knew it was in the bank. And uh, whatever he brought to the table now, at this level, I've got to adapt in that ring. And he showed tonight if things all go my way, I have a rest, and then I'll come back and I'll get stronger and stronger. And it just showed, and, that, and that's a championship fighter. Talk me through that uh, second round, because it went, man, uh, went mental when you, when you dropped him. Talk me through that. I, I just felt, I felt him, and I could tell he didn't like the power. He did not like the power. But then, I stopped. when I started catching him, he was gooey and he's gooey. Then I started swinging because he's totally leaning on me. So I thought, don't blow out, don't overdo it. Take my time, as I've, as I've done in the past, and burnt out a little bit. So I just thought, let him have a go. Got a bit more confident, started letting the shots go. But they wore out in me. I was walking through him. You know what I mean? A couple of times, he catched me, I think, the eighth round of my ear. And um, I think he's perforated my ear. But I just gritted my teeth, you know what I mean? And uh, it went all right then. But that's what you get. That's what you get in these fights. Twelve round hard fights. You've been both, you've been both athletes. You know what I mean, and um, fair play for Tommy Langford for taking the fight. Um, and it's it's brilliant for uh, Black Country Boxing there. I was just about to say, how does it feel to bring that back? So I watched the press conference. Yeah, There's a little bit of needle one there with neat, regards to no, I regions and whatnot. Nothing against him. It was other people getting involved about the West Brom. This time I was like, I'm a West Brom fan. Yeah, I do go up. I do sell a lot of tickets, but. If his fans follow him and I've got my own fans, I've probably built a lot more fans tonight. So uh, it's one of them. It's at um, the end of the day, I've come. The talking's done. I've come. I've got what I wanted. I'm happy. No disrespect to Tommy Langford or any of the team, but I know what I was coming for tonight. And to take that out of my head, I took it off him. I'm an happy man. I've done that for my mum. You know what I mean? And in that ring, he'd have probably had to kill me in that ring tonight. You know what I mean? That's how hungry I was. You know what I mean? So. It's another level, I took it to another level tonight and he's never ever been in that position and he got knocked out, got put down, got stopped but he's never had to dig deep and he, 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 was, he was hurt and that's what you get as you, as you step up and I'll probably come across other fights that do the same but I'm ready for him. Yeah because with, with, with the way he moves and boxes a lot of yeah. people thought that you may have issues sort of like cutting off the ring or, or, yeah. or you might just apply blind pressure but it was intelligent yeah. pressure that you were laying on him wasn't it? Yeah it was just control pressure, control pressure using my jab, jabbing to his body. I was going to be frustrated because obviously he was the bigger lad. He's coming, he was holding a lot, so he was smothering my work, but I just, at the end of the day, well, I just let him smother, let him, when I was in there, he's working, he's pushing me. So, my experience showed tonight, and obviously, who I've been in with, Macklin's, and I picked up advice off them through my training. He just come and I, I can, I can dog fight, and that's when I take it to him, I call him with the dug power. deep, didn't you, yeah. You dug deep, yeah. and that's when it comes into your heart, and your grit. There's one point, I think it might have been the seventh round or something, uh, you were both separated and you just sort of stopped and walked around looking at the crowd. What, yeah. what was going through your mind? Like, you, you sort of did, like, like, was just taking it in when I think, I think uh, Terry O'Connor was speaking to Langford. I don't know, I was just like, I just... Did I you feed just, off it? I just felt, I was just looking around and seeing people and it just gives me that push. It gives you that push in the head because sometimes you're, you're tired, you're looking. I've got to say, every time I went back to the court, I recovered because the training, what I've been doing and the camp, what I've had, I was ready for them 12 rounds like but I thought I thought I'd have finished him a bit early when I catched him but I just didn't want to blow out I mean I probably could have finished him earlier on but I let him have a go let him have a play and I just put the pressure on him and just showed what happened and uh, I know it's a bit early but what's what have you got any ideas what's next what you want to do next or obviously you want to enjoy the win yeah I'm gonna enjoy the win the main thing is taking this down to my mum in the morning then I've got, I'm going on my stag Beautiful and I get married it? next week. Oh! So that's that's my next plan. Congratulations for uh, then next week. It's business now. The ball's in my court. So we work off this and we do what's right for me, not what's right for other people they have had in the past. Anything you want to say to your fans, sponsors? Thanks to everyone. I just want to say thanks to Alliance Staff Holding for helping out with the BCB. 
uh, Dean Hitchcock, he's uh, sponsored me for 12 months, he's kept me off work, so I'd have been back at work, I probably wouldn't have been in as good shape as it was for him. Uh, there's a lot of people, Anthea, that pushed him with the show. Just Johnny Velocity, my strength and conditioning training. There's, there's just loads, and my family, my girlfriend Rachel, for putting up with me and <laughs> believing in myself. Like, because sometimes I can think it's too hard, it's too hard. I've got a family, got kids, I ain't earning. People don't see that side, but hopefully now the doors can open and I can earn a few quid out of the sport while I'm in it. Jason, I'm going to let you go and enjoy your win. Yeah. Thank you for speaking to Wingy Boxing, IFL TV, mm. and congratulations again. Thank you. Sponsors Bellevue vs. Hay 2 on Sky Sports Box Office.